Yeah, it certainly wasn't enough. Got to find better ways to, to move the ball and, and get some points on the football, I mean, on the board, no doubt about that. And you mentioned uh, moving the football. Uh, you got Malcolm Bellman there a bit. Tell us a bit about what he gives to the team and if you might be giving him a, look, uh, a few more looks here as the season goes on. Well, Malcolm's been in a few games throughout, throughout the year, you know. Uh, we brought him in today to try to give us a spark. Came in and played, played pretty good football. He did, and also you had Adrian Wilkins with that big kick return. Tell us a bit about uh, what he has to see. That's his second kick return for the year. Yeah, Adrian's special when he gets the ball back there. You know, it doesn't take much. Uh, when we get hats on hats, he's able to do some special things. And coach, unfortunately, penalties seem to hamper you guys today. Tell us a bit about that. Can't have penalties and win football games. Well, next week you guys are on the road to Savannah State. Tell us about how, how you're looking forward to that. Uh, we are looking forward. We all look forward to getting back on track here at Savannah State. Thank you, Coach. <laughs> All right, and uh, he provided us five fours, and that's what we wanted. Getting the big hole just you know, really set you guys out of sight dead up. The 21 nothing is. Yeah. It makes it tough. Can't play from behind uh, throughout football games. We have to start better. You, can't, you certainly can't win football games being, being in a hole like that and, and trying to get going late. And, uh, and we, we, we certainly have to start better in order to put ourselves in a better situation and win ball games. We're going to get right back to work, you know, that's all we can do. You know, we got another game versus Savannah State, uh, that's all in the schedule, and we'll get prepared and ready for them. Jordan Miles, you've been named today's defensive player of the game. Tell us a bit about uh, your performance out there today. You recorded 11 tackles. Uh, that's cool. It's unfortunate we didn't get the win today. Uh, Morgan State trotted out three different quarterbacks out there. Tell us a bit about what it was like to deal with them differently. We just didn't execute today. That's all about it. So you guys have Savannah State next week. Uh, we'll fix it. Just know we'll fix it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Lamar Scruggs, you're today's offensive player of the game, reported 92 yards receiving. Tell us a bit about your performance. Um, coaches put me in a good position to make the plays, man. We run those rides over and over in practice, man. I just made a good, good play on the ball. Malcolm got me the ball, Reed got me the ball, and I just made the play. Yeah, the big factor of that big touchdown drive here in the, you know, on the game, he had five catches on that drive. Tell us a bit about that. Um, we seen a, a seen a hole in the defense, and um, coach just knew that we had to, to attack that hole. Um, it's co basic core route, just kept, kept kept catching the ball. I mean, just kept making plays. And you mentioned uh, Malcolm Bell. He did come in later in the game. Uh, tell us a bit about what it was like having him in the game. Um, it, it was a little spurt, man. I mean, that guy, he's a good player. He's a good player. He stays after the practice. Um, we throw the ball around a little bit. I mean, we had a good little chemistry out there. So, I mean, it was about time for him to make some plays out there, and he, he definitely rose to the case. You guys have Savannah State next week. Tell us a bit about how you're looking forward to that. Say that again. Savannah State next week. Tell us a bit about how you're looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to it, man. I mean, this is a very tough loss, but, I mean, we got to put it behind us. We just got to keep pushing forward. we got five games, man. This is my last year. I mean, you got to put good stuff on film, man. We just got to keep pressing forward. Mark Scruggs, today's offensive player of the game. Chris Scruggs, you are. Thank you. Thank you. You put this behind you. Is, is that getting harder to do now when you got to do it week after week? I mean, I mean, as a football player, man, I mean, it's, it's very tough, man. But you got to have you gotta have a short-term memory, man. Um, this definitely was a, definitely a tough loss. My last homecoming, man. But we, we do believe in being 24 hours, man, and you got to put it behind us. Appreciate it, baby. Yeah.